में जिम्मे गिक सो द क्वेश्चन इज दे जे एस पी वर्सेज पी एच पी आई हैव ऑलरेडी डन अ वीडियो समन आस्क मी द सिमिलर क्वेश्चन इज जे एस पी वॉट एट आई विल बी सेइंग दैट यूज जे एस पी और जावर सर्वर पेज इफ यू आर गोइंग टू बिल्ड फॉर इफ यू आर गोइंग टू बिल्ड वेबसाइट व्हिच आर रिलेटेड फॉर डीलिंग विद मनी विद फाइनेंस विद बैंकिंग स्पेशली मोस्ट ऑफ द बैंकिंग वेबसाइट आर आर ऑलवेज बिल्डिंग जे एस पी और जावा एम सर्वर पेज और एनी काइंड ऑफ जावा फ्रेमवर्क If you're going to start, I mean, if you're going to start your own startup, you are going to build like an e-commerce website and web application, web app. PHP, PHP, PHP. I'm a PHP fanboy. I'm a PHP lover. But still, I'm going to give you like my honest opinion. I will be using GSP if I'm going to build an application for bank. But I do not have a degree. You don't know. I if you don't, I do not have a degree. Then you should know I don't have a degree. So for me, getting a job as a JSP developer is freaking hard unless I have like ten years Java, I mean, experience under my belt, which I don't. The maximum like four years Java experience I have. But for PHP, you can get a job without degree. So, in conclusion, use JSP if you're going to build like, like finance application. But if you're going to just build a regular web app similar to Facebook, JSP is overkill. Stay away from JSP because it's overkill. You need to write extra line of code. The deb debugging is another hell of problem. PHP is more forgiving where JSP is not. It was me. If you have any question, leave in the comment box below. Make sure to check out my two new YouTube channel. The links are in the description box below. Bye.